Hi, I'm Merrick D'Amato. And I'm going to give this a spin. And welcome back to <laughs> Mind Breakers. Yeah. That would have worked out better if yeah. it was like a triple entendre. If we would still have the wheel going. Yeah. Still. Still. Welcome back to Mind Breakers. We got, uh, um, we got another Geo movie for you today. We got a movie. I didn't, I didn't pick this one. This one got scheduled by Merrick. But you did pick it for the selection. Of course. I bought this and this came in the Man Eater trilogy yeah, box. We're finishing off the first Man Eater trilogy with the first wave. Lance Hedrickson in the Spider's Web. Yeah. It's uh this one's a pretty uh pretty out there one. It looks a little weird and uh, When a team of backpackers of sets out to explore the Indian jungles, one of them is bitten by a poisonous spider and killed. Uh-huh. Forced to seek the help of Dr. La Corpus, Golden Globe nominee Lance Hendrickson, an American physician living in the local village, the group quickly discovers that the village has a venomous ritual in which crawling spiders feast on corpses. In the Spider's Web is a thriller that is sure to make your skin crawl and the hairs on the back of your neck rise, now available for the first time on DVD. Mm-hmm. Because everyone was clamoring. Yeah, they that, always they were all in the theaters, like, jumping over Because it's ever got into theaters. <laughs> yeah, trying to, uh, trying the to cover, get tickets. The cover has a big, big old spider on it. Yeah. I'm really hoping that there are actually giant spiders in this movie, Gio. I don't think they are. I think they're just like like uh, genetically uh, altered spiders. That's boring. Yeah, but uh, it's still gonna be a little a little weird. I'm sure. I hope point. they at least are big PS2 spiders that piss on the camp. Oh well, they're gonna. <laughs> from what I saw, they don't look great. <laughs> Fucking blood monkey, man. But uh, we're gonna see exactly how bad it gets. Do the spiders urinate on the camp though. Spiders don't piss. How do you know? I know they don't, because I, I know a lot of things about spiders. Maybe they just do, but haven't told anyone. I know a fuck ton about spiders. Spiders okay. could be pissing on you right now, viewers. The, yeah, with their, also, venomous, their venomous jizz piss. Also, uh, viewers at home, you might not know this, but there is actually a spider very slowly crawling up the back of your neck right now. Some of you checked! Some of you checked! Let's watch this shit. <laughs> You're a fucking mong. Thank you. In the jungle, nobody expects danger to be so small. Oh god! That spider! Oh god, it bit me. So what do we do? Oh my god. <laughs> Apparently this American doctor lives among the villagers. Been there for years. We should leave right now. But unfortunately, your friend was bitten by a Bolivian Baja spider. That doctor gave me the creep. Now. I don't remember this. With one bite. One of our group got bit by a spider. A spider? These friends will become entangled. Probably more people on this wall than there are in the actual town. I'm going back with you. In a web of evil. Come on. Lion. For them, spiders are gods. They never. She's paralyzed. Venom, no pain, saw coming. Help me! Help me! Did you think you'll ever get out of this jungle alive? The Talawar will cut you down and I'll barter with your organs. In the spider's web. Wait a minute, we're just getting to the good stuff here. This may be the stupidest fucking movie we've watched in a long time. This movie is liquidized shit. It's diarrhea. It's awful. (laughs) Like, seriously, I feel awful for, like... Subjecting myself to like any more than I than than I had to. Don't watch this movie. It's not worth it's it. It's not entertaining. <laughs> it's it's not even like okay. It's bad. You can sit down with your friends and watch it, and it'll be just funny enough to be bad. Like it'll just be bad enough to be funny. But but like, not. It's not it's, it's, worth it. It is not. It it won't exceed those expectations. It will not get get any any worse than you think it's going to be. Mm, well, mm, it kind of did. Yeah, no, it was it was like it was literally like basic like 
this is the shit we're gonna get up to, no more, no less. Because like we were there were some surprises. Yeah, but we were expecting to actually like see the big spiders attacking. Fuckers. Yeah, there aren't really any giant spiders, and I'm very disappointed by. There them. are, but there aren't. There, they, we'll there are that. technically, but we have no proof of the giant spiders. No, we do. Like we see them in comparison to the smaller. Ones. We don't see them in comparison to humans, so it doesn't matter. True. They don't kill. Well, that's any- the problem. They don't kill anyone. Yeah, but that's the problem right there. Like in that lies the issue. Like, if it actually compared them, like, if it had them on screen with these actors, it would be a better film. The first thing we see is a guy with long-ass fingernails doing science and eating a spider. First thing we see is him eating a spider. Yeah. Like, just dropping that shit into his mouth. And we we just see him, like, slip on a, a little white medical glove. He starts doing things. He can only wear one, though, because his right hand is long-ass claws of doom. Yeah. Which, like, yeah, he, he can only wear the one. Mm. Which, honestly, like, makes his, like, his, his right hand really nasty. Like, really gross and dirty. I think this movie's fucking it's gross, dude. This nasty ass, like, this movie is gross, dude. Grime all over his fucking nails and shit. Like, seriously, needs a manicure, this guy. <sighs> but, like, yeah, it gets. It gets worse than that, though. Like, we end up seeing, like, what his brother looks like and fuck, yeah. is that a nightmare. Cool design, though. It's a good design. Good idea. Very good idea. Like, uh, a little bit of, uh, a little bit of an interesting, like, You know what's sad there. about it, though? What? Given the quality of all the fucking effects in that movie, that's, that's the best what the, No, that's what the guy actually looks like. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. <laughs> For real? Yeah! <laughs> Fucking... Okay, we'll discuss that in a second, actually. Let's get to that, at least. So, uh, yeah, credits over scientist guy. I uh, wish we could just camera. skip through this and not review this. Yeah. It's like... He eats the camera. You know what this... Re- CGI spiders everywhere. <laughs> this review reminds me of something that happens a lot when I Let's Play. What? The thought of, hey! Like, when I'm having this is a part of not liking the game, like, I know! I'll just fast forward through it in post! I'll just speed it up or like cut it out. Wait, I still have to do it before I can edit it in post. Shit. Yeah, exactly. Fuck. You do not exactly have uh, control over the uh, over the time. Yeah. It's uh, you don't have that kind of stand. Barely have control over my time. <laughs> exactly. Why else would I watch fucking movies like this? Same room. I don't even get paid, dude. <laughs> neither do we. So. Uh, Are you venom now? With it, neither do we. Neither do I. I thought Nelson was the Venom dude. I am we. We are many peoples in our heads. Uh, so there we then like there are many CGI spiders that look awful in this film. We get a bunch of idiot tourists being led through the jungle. Yeah, they see many a spider webs. And then they find that a, look like they came from the dollar store. And then they find the village from Temple of Doom. <laughs> yeah. After, uh, after uh, one of their one of their little tourist friends end up getting bitten by a spider. Yeah, we're rushing through this bit because it's really not important. <laughs> yeah, not really. Aside from uh, aside from like one of the things they say at the campfire when they're resting, which is uh, Gina complains all the time. Yeah, we have Gina who complains all the time. A black girl with a camera. The woman who gets bitten, who I can't remember anything about her except she's the first to die. Their idiot guide. Geraldine, I think her name is. Geraldine, was. their idiot guide. Yeah. Some guy with a beard. Uh-huh. And the guy who I guess is supposed to be hot. Uh, yeah, Guy John, I think? Maybe. Yeah. But, uh, they, they just basically end up getting to this this little weird village. Oh, like, understatement. It's, it's a weird village. Like, it's a creepy fucking village. And, like, they, they have, like, spider tattoos of, like, tribal all over them. Yeah, they're, they're, they're brought to this village by a swords. random man who just stands there ominously with a sword. <laughs> yeah, <just> looking <laughs> grumpy. Foreshadowing swordsman. <laughs> He's just... Like, seriously foreboding swordsman. <laughs> his job is to stand there being foreboding. <laughs> yes. That seems like the entire reason they had this indigenous peoples. Like, just, just, just stand around and look foreboding. Like, like everybody, like everybody that's an extra in this movie is basically doing the like the the weird Dio thing where he's like standing on top of his mansion, mm. like looking eerie. 
Like, I was expecting them half of uh, Like, I was half expecting them to just start going, in <laughs> Like, just start giving us, like, extra style. Yeah, like, loud JoJo screams. <laughs> ora, 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 ora. Muda, muda, muda. <laughs> so, uh, See you, boy. <laughs> fucking spiders. That's my stand. Fucking spiders? I feel like that's my stand, <laughs> is something is something you want to tell us, Gio? Yours would be like no. Yours would be like fucking like uh, not not war pigs. Nelson has war pigs. You would have like fucking heavy road mental crew. breakdown. It's my theme song. Yeah, or like we are the road crew, or um the metal, <laughs> the metal. <laughs> I feel like Mike would have the metal. Hmm. Would would Mike have the metal? I don't know. Or, or Mike Retta. I feel like you would have it. Uh, fuck. Like, yeah, this whole village is kind of weird. They're giving them, like, random gifts. All the village people. It was kind of like... In the Navy! <laughs> they're not in the Navy. <laughs> they're they're literally giving them, like, gourds and, like, beads. And fruit. And, and fruits. And Isn't eight... a gourd a fruit? No, a gourd is a... It's not, it's not food. Yeah, gourd is a... A gourd is a fruit. It's an empty. It's, it, it's a hollowed out empty yam, dude. You can't. You can't do anything with you it. Can't eat a gourd. No, it's it's been eaten. It's the shell. Oh, like the actual like gourd is just the shell of it. Yeah. Okay. Well, I it think explains why they use them as models. I feel like there would be meat to a gourd. Whatever. But uh, yeah, this place is called like Kalimata. Of course it is because <laughs> yeah. because of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? And they get brought to this weird ass doctor. Like I was like, it is this town. Let me guess, Kalima, Kalimata. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> well, like it's a weird ass like spider village. Like they're gonna have death shit related to the name. Like Kali is the god of death. And and they at they 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 keep referencing shit they're not allowed to actually say the name of. Yeah. Like that colonel. Like, in, now. like the colonel at the end of that movie. Yeah. <laughs> And who lives with all the natives, you know, <laughs> got off the boat and whatnot. They might as well have said gotten off the boat. <laughs> like, they seriously should have. They might as well have just fucking gone for it. Like, do that shit. It's like, hey, we'd like to refer... Hey, um, F- Francis Ford Coppola, do you mind if we... Ma- you- can we give you a shout-out in our movie, talk about Apocalypse Now? Uh, sure, let me Security! see... Security! It's like, sure, <laughs> like, sure, let me read the script. No, fuck you. <laughs> Police! Address these fuckers. <laughs> these talentless hacks. So, uh, yeah, they end up they end up seeing this like cultist guy. He's like in like a, a raggy head. Yeah. Like he's got he's got fingernails too. And like he looks really creeped out, like fucking fucking weird guy. He's got like a normal looking chin, like a normal bottom half of his face, really. Yeah, he was disappointing. Yeah, but like I don't know, he's kind of. He was disappointing. I was expecting worse. Yeah, compared to what I thought worse. he was gonna be, he was disappointing. We were both expecting worse. But what he ended up turning out to be, like, okay, that was like probably all of the creativity they had in their entire bodies, probably. like interacting with this one guy. But uh, they end up, like, uh, they end up seeing him, and he's foreboding. Uh, like, wanders into the village to give the doctor medical supplies. And, like, all of the explorers are like, yeah, creepy guy with sack on his head? Yeah, we should get the fuck out of here now. You should get the fuck out of Dodge. Yeah. And, like, uh, Black Girl is like, oh, no, but I want to stay, though. So Gina's she... like, what the fuck? And, so and, and she... then she's like, but no, though, I want to stay. <laughs> so the beard guy, the Gina and the hot guy find Jungle Bus. <laughs> they find jungle bus. They do. <laughs> and they get back to town and nothing interesting happens with them for a while. Oh, but, but this is while uh, Black Girl Yeah, and... well, that's, I was getting to that. Yeah. Black Girl and Tour Guide yeah. go into a spider temple, yeah. get hopelessly <laughs> lost, 
<laughs> they go there with one of the guys that's like holding a sword. But he just ditches them because of he course he just babs away the second the camera turns back to him. <laughs> and he's just like, hey, you're going in first, right? Gone. <laughs> And instead of doing the smart thing and like, oh, okay, never mind, they go okay, let's deeper go in because <laughs> they're stupid. The <laughs> they're so stupid. The fact they're going into the spider temple is stupid enough to begin with. Like, honestly, you should not be going to the fucking spider temple. Like, I okay, I might if there was a guide with me, like who knew it and knew the the safe thing yeah, to do. Yeah, of course, but they didn't have anybody else. That's the thing. Like when they're going in first with the guy with the sword. Okay, cool. You're just, you're, you're being shown a local landmark. When they leave, like, when even the locals don't want to be around this, this fucking thing. This is the landmark. Yeah. This is their, like, this is their fucking Leaning Tower of Pisa right here. This is their fucking the Eiffel leading Tower. Leaning Tower of, spe- of Spiders. <laughs> yeah. This is their fucking Eiffel Tower of Spiders. This is their Spider Tower. They go in, and they get fucking, they get fucking lost. Uh, of course. They see a bunch of fucking shitty animated spiders. Like, they, like so bad, they're not... I, I said Adobe After Effects, but that's too generous. Seriously. They're a Facebook filter. Yeah. This is like Halloween Facebook filter right here. But, like, oh god, it gets, like, so much worse, though, because, like, it could have even improved on that. They could have improved on it in, like, such subtle little ways, but they didn't. Well, why would they? That would be effort, Geo. <sighs> I know. You expect is, effort from these people? Yeah, which is less than what they have. They made a movie called In the Spider's Web, which ends up being a Scooby-Doo plot. I wish I could even say the villain was its only saving grace, but it's really not even. Like, he barely he's barely even on screen sometimes. Like, I can't even name off the top of my head one thing Lance Henriksen was in. Like, seriously, neither can I. So, it's like, hey, we have Lance Henriksen. Who? Like, but that's the thing. I know the name. Yeah. I know the name Lance Henriksen. It rings bells. But I don't know what to connect it to. <laughs> like, I know he I know he did something. Yeah. <laughs> don't know what. <laughs> nothing nothing important enough for you us to remember, apparently. If you want, you can go ahead and I Yeah, you, right you keep forward. talking about the spider cave. Yeah. Uh, before this, like, the spider bro just ended up, like, disappearing behind an elephant. <laughs> and, like... I, I said... I, I was call- just like, well, there he goes! <laughs> oh, the only interesting thing, most of the movie, is there was a, there was a um, an elephant going by... And I, out of nowhere, because my brain hasn't been working he properly just today. farted and called it a monkey. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously think your head's still in Blood Monkey. <laughs> he was... Seriously oh, he was in Aliens. Oh, in Alien vs. He was the... He was the... He was, um... The robot. He was Bishop. Yeah. Hard Target's cool, also. Mm-hmm. I remember him in Hard Target, though. Like, I, wa- I watched that fucking Van Damme movie years ago. A Van Damme movie. It's, it's got Jean-Claude in it. So that's Lance Henriksen. Okay. I was about to say Jean-Pierre pulled the ref. <laughs> Jean-Pierre. I was about to say fucking Jean-Pierre pulled the ref. <laughs> yeah, John, uh, Jean-Claude Van Damme. Yo, they need to make a JoJo with fucking Jean-Claude Van Damme playing Jean-Pierre pulled the ref. He's too old. <laughs> no, do it though. But he's too old. I'm not saying he's too old for JoJo. I'm saying he's too old. Is in <laughs> general, yeah. he's too old to be alive. <laughs> Period. He's Just hot kill him. Now. Just let him die. Yeah. Speaking of hot flashes, while they're in the cave, the black girl's holding the fucking camera, and the camera, not even her, she's not even getting these flashes. <laughs> the camera is getting fucking LSD trips of the fucking. It goes all back, bro. It goes all <laughs> Ghost Rider two, David and Square, like. Dee, 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 dee. Yeah, and it's still like the whole the whole trip is through the lens of the camera, so you're just like, where the fuck did she get this? And this is the thing, she reacts. Like it actually happened. <laughs> yeah, for real. She's like, oh. oh. <laughs> but like, like she got it from like a fucking like like she found the tape in like the basement of some fucking like drug trip like fucking crack house. <laughs> and she just put it in her camera and then she's like, oh, I guess I'll use this for my expedition. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna use for my footage here. <laughs> and then just whoa, and she's fucking going around the cave. So Fuck both me. she and the and the guy get get uh, spidered. Yeah. 
we go back to the town. And... Guy first, though, which I was like, yeah, let fucking Brian die first. Yeah, like, he dies. Fuck this asshole. Uh, at the moment, <laughs> uh, camera chick, not dead. Yeah. She's, uh, she's, she's just wandering around until she finds a bunch of the spooters. Um... And she gets wrapped up. There, this is where the first time we see the big spider footage. Yeah, but we don't. But it, we it's, don't see it do anything. <laughs> yeah, it's just the whole footage. Like we never see it do anything. Mm. We never see the big spiders do anything aside from crawling around, like crawling forward. There is a funny scene though, like when, just crawling like, forward, like right out of Rage of the Lost Ark. Yeah, where um, there's a spider on the girl's back. Yeah. And Brian has no goddamn idea what to do. Yeah. But like this happens twice. Like the first, his first his first thought is to twist his shirt up like a towel and try to and rip it, it. and I'm like <laughs> six feet pa- like six paces away. Like, it's like trying to fucking you know why that's off. a stu- you're gonna scare the spider <laughs> and then the spider's gonna bite her. You dumbass. You might as well have just like take it like ripped his shirt off and flung it around to his head, going woo. <laughs> that happens at some point in the movie. Remember? Yeah. yeah. When the cop comes in. <laughs> but fucking really, though. <laughs> like, then, then they step on a spider. Yeah. Like, right after that, like, they step on one. And then they're like, oh, well, now we're fucked. <laughs> we pissed off Kali. Christ. You betrayed Shiva. <laughs> yeah, fucking Shilob's gonna come after their ass. <laughs> fucking Wolf <Lolf> is <laughs> pissed. <laughs> you know what I'd ra- You know what this... I'm not surprised this movie sucks. Oh, neither am I. Because every level in every video game where the only enemies you fight are fucking spiders sucks. Yeah. Well, you fuck know, spiders, man. Yeah. Like, no, you need you need uh, you need flavor to mm. your enemy repertoire, you know. But that, and that, that's the problem with the spiders. Spiders yeah. only show up in levels with nothing but spiders. Not always. Usually, uh, there's like uh, like there's a there's a mine in Skyrim. Mm. Where you're wandering around and uh, you're basically trying to find like this hidden entrance. Fuck the frostbite spiders in Skyrim. Yeah, but there's there's you a couple of them in there. You know what's worse than the frostbite spiders? What the chorus? Oh yeah, those are pieces of shit. I the, fucking the hate giant those. fucking earwigs. There's a reason I got full auto flame crossbows. <laughs> like seriously, fuck those assholes. But <laughs> not only are they hard to fight, they also scare the fucking shit out of me. Yeah. But, like, down in that cave, yeah. like, down in that mine, there's, like, there's Skeevers, there's, uh, there's, there's Draugr, there's a couple of other, like, things. There's not just, so it's not just, just spiders. I mean, like, yeah. th- there's, the sh- there's a level in Lord of the Rings with just spiders. Yeah, I know. But, like, like, uh, shit, if they just literally just had spiders in that cave, like, yeah, I was, because, like, when I was going down in that mine, I was expecting just, just spiders the whole way through. And it wasn't what we got, so, so I was glad. We're in town with um, Genie and Hot Guy. Yeah, they end up getting to uh, Ka- Kanati. Yeah, we, Kanati. They Miller. go to see the. They go to see the see the police. Yeah, there's and a there's there, yeah. my favorite character in the movie. The only character I don't want to see die. Yeah, it's pretty chill. I like him. He's the a sergeant, chill guy. and yeah. we just see this police office has just a wall of missing, of missing posters. posters. Yeah. <laughs> and and one of them is literally the old police officer of the like the old sheriff of the town basically. Mm. And it's like yeah, he went he went missing like two months ago. Uh, on I've MGH. been here on MGH, uh, and and I've been here like two weeks apparently. Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks without eating spiders. Two what? weeks. Get ready for a surprise. Boom. Two two weeks. Two two, two weeks. Two two weeks. Hey, Benny, remember when I told you I would give you uh, I'll give you last life? The, the, that's not what you're saying to me. Ben's the, Ben's the guy you fight with a knife. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it! Ar- Arnold, did you even read the script? They're eating her! They're eating her, though! And then they're gonna eat me! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no, she hates it, though! <laughs> Oh no, she's getting the webs all over. Okay, her. Uh, we, we can't reference Super Best Friends anymore. We have to stop this though. We they have, hate it. We, they hate it though. Stop it, Joe. <laughs> so, 
Move on so I can forget about this fucking movie. The girl's like, the girl's like, if I ever go missing, at least give them a pretty picture of me, so at least I look dead gorgeous when and they put my face on the missing. And we're just here like we fucking hate you. Yeah, like everybody get the fuck out of this movie, except the police evil police sergeant, <laughs> evil guy, fucking police dude. You're cool. Stay. You too. Fight. So the police officer is like, so what was his village? And they give the name of the fucking village to him. And he's like, oh shit! And he's like, oh no, that fucking place, oh shit, okay, I better get in the car and go. So he gets in this jeep, drives down there. We must go to Pankot Palace! <laughs> he ends up, like, getting out, seeing, uh, seeing a helicopter, mm. like, landed. And, and they're transporting this, stuff into the helicopter. And this is a random a guy with a big ass machine gun. Yeah, a fucking M60. There's just some bald ass white dude with an M60. No, he's not white. He's he's white. Dude, he's a bald guy doing the various things to the black market with a heavy machine gun. He is Russian. <laughs> you cannot deny it. He is Russian. <laughs> no. You know why? why? You know how I know? How? Not a single grenade, and he's not wearing the little toque. He would be wearing his toque everywhere. <laughs> also, he's not wearing a right, white and red striped shirt, but so he, he can't possibly be the Russian. He's not the Russian, he's just a Russian. But he can't be the Russian! You know he who, can't. Well, he could either be a big, a giant, a steroid, a roided up Where's Waldo, or he could be a tiny gray cat. No, he can't. Because... No, he can, dude. Cat, cats and dogs. No, because the bullets Russian. are like spiders to the Russian. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're, we gotta keep going here. So he gets found out at this helicopter spot. So and he, he, he gets goes, held up. He gets captured, and they they bring him to the village, going whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> spinning their shirts. Spinning their shirts, but they are going whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> and just the, the evil the evil scientist is just like, I'm sorry, these people are fucking stupid. So they, they get on my nerves too. So what are you doing here? I know about the helicopter. Well, uh, that's just to get its supplies into the village and stuff. I saw you putting things on there. Fuck! <laughs> so he's like, it's okay. I'll take you to uh, I'll take you to the cave. It's like, you want to come along? Okay, I guess I'll go with you. <laughs> So, I'll take you, it's fine, I'll take you to the cave. That, that doesn't sound like a nice place. Just does not sound like that a does not sound like a nice place to go. <laughs> I should have to stay in my but, PlayStation and drink. But, 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 but we, had some, we had some tourists who just walked right in. The, the tourists are stupid, man. Why, why would... Why, you know how... Why did you say the tourists are stupid? Why the hell would they come here? <laughs> They don't know where they're Why going. are they going to the middle of the fucking jungle? <laughs> they don't know where they're going. They're going to get eaten by the giant CGI spiders that inhabit this area. I don't know if this is a good idea, my friends. <laughs> they're not CGI. The practical effect. No, stop lying to yourself, man. We're it's embarrassing. Lying. It's embarrassing. You are embarrassing yourself, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> we should stop being racist. <laughs> That's how it speaks, though. I know, but we're being racist. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, I'm not. I have fucking Indian family, okay? He goes into the cave. Yeah. And spoilers, somehow survives? <laughs> yeah. He's, he's one of the, 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 he's one of the best of them, though. Like, he, he actually makes it out of there. And everyone else Fucking goes, rad. and everyone goes into the cave after them. And we find out, brace yourself, yep. that the whole spider cult is a front to steal organs from tourists and sell them at the black market. <laughs> but that's not even the dumbest part to me. But it's 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 dumb. It's it's out there. It's up yeah, there. Yeah, it's 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 up there. Because it's the For real. But like, I feel like two rungs up is my problem. <laughs> but just this thing with the with the black market sp organ theft thing. Yeah. That is Scooby Doo level stupid. Bro, oh, for real, this would guy. Well, it, this it, guy it, would be on an episode. I it's Curse Scoob of Spider Island. Or it's something. as stupid as Scooby Doo, without the charm of Scooby Doo. Yeah, at least if we had like because Scooby Doo's at least fun. I like Scooby Doo. Yeah, at least if the gang was out there, it'd be like, oh, Raggy, I guess we're gonna go on a drug trip right now. Wow! And then at least you'd have the smart one, who's the, who's like, hey, gang, let's go all explore the spider cave. 
Zoinks, that sounds like a bad idea, friend. You're gonna get like, so fucking killed. That was like spiders can kill you in about three seconds with their poison. And hey, friends like they're not really spiders, they're just guys in suits. Like, friend, that's fucking stupid. <laughs> I thought you were gonna be like. I thought you were gonna be like. Fred's just smacking the shit out of Velma because she's the only one talking sense. <laughs> He's just beating her ass. <laughs> they're not spiders. They're guys in suits. Fred, you're fucking stupid. I thought I was the high one. <laughs> I, I go into this cave and he drinks some ayahuasca. <laughs> Oh, man. And then they meet Macho Man Randy Savage in there. I wish. That'd be fucking cool. <laughs> no, they meet, like, fucking, uh... They meet fucking, uh... The Mind. They meet Jesse the Mind Ventura. <laughs> so they're, um... They're fucking around in the cave. They meet up with a cop. Yeah. And... I think they... They have their falling... A lot. They have the same shot of falling down a pit for a few, a few times. Yeah, they both have like. A, okay, the two of the two of the uh, the fuckers there, the the white girl and the and John there, they both end up like running off the exact same cliff into the exact same pit of spider webs, mm. and they both fall like five layers down, and they don't see any spiders down there. It's just webs. And they managed to dig their way out of it. I don't know how they fucking climbed out of this fucking thing. But anyway, well, like, the they... fucking layout of this cave is borked. Like, this there's movie no... movie is borked. Yeah, but there's no, like, structure to this cave. There's no structure to this movie. That's true also. But, like, it just, it makes so little sense how the fuck they're able to just navigate this place. So there's a big spider ritual. It turns out... Yeah, she, this um, is where shit's really going on. Camera down. girl's alive... She's alive, but she's screaming and paralyzed. Yeah. Like she gets, uh, she gets injected by evil Doctor Man. Yeah. Uh, fucking uh, Doc Lecorpus. Uh, they probably Lecorpus. should have guessed he was evil just from the fact that his name is Lecorpus. Ah, my name is Doctor Lecorpus. Oh, you you sound totally trustworthy. Are you a necromancer? No, I'm a spider man, sir. I study spiders. Well, you're clearly you're you're clearly you're clearly somebody. stable. We can clearly trust you. <laughs> yeah. Here, we will trust the care of our wounded user. Yes, I'm an arachnologist. It's not a thing. Yeah, there's Edemol. actually people Isn't that study spiders. Entomologist that studies all bugs. Uh, no, there's like one specific one that's like oh. specifically focuses on spiders. Uh, uh, Angelina Jolie's husband in Salt, uh, in the movie Salt. Yeah, he was an arachnologist or whatever. Like, I there's haven't a specific seen name that for movie. I don't like Angelina Jolie. But I watched it. <laughs> but like, yeah, her husband in that movie studies spiders, and like, they actually have like a name and they say it. But like, it's something like an arachnologist. Wait, are you telling me know. that there's a person whose job is to study spiders, mm -hmm. and this person somehow gets to marry Angelina Jolie mm -hmm. in the movie? Weird. Yeah. But she's a, she's a special agent, so... You know what that reminds she's me of? She's basically Black Widow. You know what that reminds me of? What? Every movie where Arnold Schwarzenegger is supposed to be a scientist. Yeah. Well, in this one, Andrew Lee Jolie was a Russian spy, so she's basically Black Widow. <laughs> and I guess, like, that's the whole reason they gave her the spider-loving husband? Yeah. Like, fuck it, whatever. We're not talking about salt. Good. <laughs> we gotta stop talking about salt here and get back to this shit. So yeah. she's paralyzed. Yeah. Uh, everybody's tweaking out, fucking eating spiders, fucking doing their tantric sex dances, and, like, getting, getting, like, crotch to ass with each other, like, fucking making spider formations with their arms. Yeah, it's... Making little butt fuck choo-choo trains. It's a very strange scene. It's a weird fucking scene. <laughs> and, like, I was, I was just there digging the scene, and they were like... Uh, we gotta go save her. Like, uh, they're like, what are we gonna do? So, like, uh, I think, like, the John guy ends up getting grabbed. And he's like, uh, he goes to the girl, like, run! And she runs headlong towards the black girl. And he's like, not that way! <laughs> so then she ends up, like... I guess, like, she grabbed, like, she grabbed a torch at some point and threw it at a guy. <laughs> and the guy's just like, hey. <laughs> and the, there are a few torches in the ritual that aren't, like, 
what you'd expect. They're torches you get. A- yeah, they're just like Verbena candles on like the edges of fucking. They're tiki torches, torches yeah. that you get a Canadian time. <laughs> yeah, they're like there's they're, they're the tiny little like uh, backyard torches that you have at barbecues. They're the ones that briefly was were claimed by neo Nazis. <laughs> oh fuck. So they end up like I guess like getting uh, getting the black girl out. And then running around like uh, like chickens with their head cut off after after Doctor Lacorpus ends up like telling them like yes I paralyzed her like uh, she will not be getting up anytime soon. I'm selling yeah. organs on the black market. He doesn't outright say it though. Uh, really? Yes, that's my evil plan. You're selling organs on that's the black market. That's fucking stupid, guy. <laughs> You're fucking dumb. <laughs> it's like well that's my plan though. Your plan is dumb. Your plan is bad, and you should feel bad. Oh yes, have you met my brother? He has a sack on his head. Yeah, we saw him. Yeah, he's the reason we should have left a long time ago. He has fucking nightcrawler powers, anyways. <laughs> so they fucking they run around a whole bunch of the fucking places. Uh, white girl hides somewhere, throws a spider at some guy's face. And the spider ends up apparently biting him immediately in the eye socket and killing him instantly. And then they just fuck off because whatever, who cares? I don't. Yeah. <laughs> and then, like, they they see the fucking, they see the web hole, they fell down. And then when they get out, they talk about fucking Margaritaville. Uh, the whole plan for the organ stealing ends up getting Look, like, fucking exposed. Dr. LaCorpus falls down the pit. He doesn't fall down right away. Like we get, he falls like at the end. But like right here, we have the big problem. Like my main oh, problem with this fucking whole thing. Do tell. They see tubes. Oh yeah. Running through the cave. Yeah, that's where we find out from the, the bottom of a hole. Spider pit with a fuck ton of spiders in. They're it. not pumping out spiders. Yeah, like they're not pumping out spiders. No, it's tubes with like goo pumping through them. Yeah, and. They end up getting to the chamber underneath the underneath the pit, like underneath all the fucking spider webs in the hole. They get there and they notice that he's under there, like doing all the stuff with the organs and whatnot. But he's funneling fucking <sighs> spider venom through these tubes. How? <laughs> my thoughts. Ex- my question exactly. Because, like, they're not hooked up to, like, a fucking spider-biting like, machine the thing. here. If, if, these, if we had followed these like, tubes no. <laughs> and they'd led to, like, a King Kong-sized spider, yeah, that would have been awesome. Yeah, they into the fucking machine and it's like, ah! But it's, I, I guess it assumes that spiders just leak venom. Yeah. But they don't. Like, like a, it finally leads to, like, the mama alien. Yeah. And she's, like, screaming, breeding, like, a whole bunch of big-ass fucking spider eggs. We don't get that. Like, no. Instead, it's just literally tubes with black goo being pumped through them from fuck knows where, and apparently this is spider venom that paralyzes people. And he's using this on his victims to preserve their, uh, their organs for longer. You know? To, to keep their, uh, their, uh, their organs. I don't know why anyone buys organs from him on the black market, because he wraps all the organs in spider webs. <laughs> well, like, spider webs claw. Like, they, <laughs> they look they look the same in this movie, honestly. So, why would like, you wrap an organ in cloth, though, when you're putting it in the freezer? Well, like, spider webs are made to preserve the flesh also. Yeah. Like, that's, it, what, it's they're, still, that's it's, what they're for. I'm just assuming it's stupid because it's this movie. It is very dumb, because, like, fuck, we have, like, plastic bags nowadays. Yeah, so you don't need to wrap it in fucking spider webs! Yeah, but then again, he's not going to get shipped in some Ziploc bags. <laughs> it's like it's like the second you start getting mass shipments of Ziploc bags, it's just like, okay, you're either a drug dealer or you're using these things for fucking organ transplants. Or you just really like to, or you just have a lot of kids and give them bags of Cheerios. Yeah, because that's what he's doing. He's packing all of these people that live in the villages fucking lunches, <laughs> lunchables. <laughs> it, that's what they're doing. <laughs> Would you be surprised with this movie if that's what they were doing? What, feeding the everybody Lunchables? Yeah. Yes, I would be surprised. So, the, the villain fuck? dies. Yeah, uh, they go down, like, a rope bridge, and then, like, white girl ends this up This movie off doesn't deserve us to talk about it this much. Let's hurry this the <laughs> fuck up, Gio. She throws him off the edge. He falls in the hole. And there's four shots of the same giant spider crawling towards yeah. him like in a row and the spider doesn't bite him yeah it never shows up like we said like the big spider never interacts with the actors nope. 
Never. Not fucking that's, once. that's a generous term. It's so fucking... Yeah, actorism. <laughs> it's a very generous <laughs> term for these people. <laughs> people is a generous term. <laughs> okay, that's too much. You're going a bit too far there. Especially after the whole... Oh, no, 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 that we had before. <laughs> yeah, but I'm talking about... Dude, I'm talking about a bunch of white people. It's fine. Yeah. So this necklace that never consequented to fucking anything ends up breaking and she ends up climbing up this big fucking spider silk rope. And John's on the other end of a fucking hole. And the and the cop's like, we'll be back for you at some point. I don't know when. He dies. He, no, he doesn't die. He's, he just gets paralyzed. And, like, wrapped up in... And he's definitely going soil. to die. At some point, yeah. Nobody saves his ass. But we see we see a little bit before this, the army show up. Yep. And well, we, no, after this, the army shows up. Because Beardy Guy went to talk to them about the disappearances. Yeah, and they kill a uh, raghead guy. Yep. And we find his they, creepy they unmask him. spider face. Yeah, and it's just old man Jenkins. <laughs> but he has, his brain's all, defo- his head's all deformed. His head? And he has a hole in his head. His head spiders. is a farm for spiders. <laughs> That is the entire, that is the entire crux of this man's life, is his head is home for spiders. And that's fucking, that's the end of the fucking movie right there. I don't even know if we can fucking say anything else about this. This movie is stupid, and I give it a bag of stupid. It must, I, I sense it's this movie to be trampled to death by monkeys. I give this movie... Three guys with fucking spider uh, spiders living in their fucking head because that's the people that made this film. I give this movie that one random newspaper cli- clipping of Mahatma Gandhi pinned up on the wall in that one scene. <laughs> hey, look, Merrick, it's that monkey god over there. Yes, Gio. Hey, look, it's a monkey god, though. He's got the big trunk and everything. Oh, no, I hate you. <laughs> Oh no, he loves this movie though. <laughs> so next time we're at least gonna have something entertaining, hopefully. Yeah. As we go as we take tackle something we haven't looked at in a long time. Yep. Marvel. Yeah. It's gonna be one of the weirder Marvel movies I think we've ever seen. Mm, Doctor Strange. It's still Oh no, that was one of the bo- more boring Marvel movies we've ever seen. Definitely. And also this one's like way more like obscure, I'd say. Like, to, to say the least about it, it's going to be fucking obscure. Well, see you guys next time. Bye, I hope you enjoyed. Fuck this movie. Fuck it! <laughs>